Good morning YouTube. Today is... Well, I have no idea what today is. Today is March 11th, 2017. Today is the second special showing for OKC Cars and Coffee down at the OKC Auto Show. And the event the event ends at 11, so I'm probably not going to get anything of Cars and Coffee. I woke up kind of late. I didn't get to bed till like 3 o'clock in the morning, so I slept in a little bit. And it's all nasty and rainy outside, so quick update. I got to the fairgrounds. There was no people at Cars and Coffee. The event was completely off, which I kind of expected that because the showing was very limited due to everybody saying that they didn't want to come because it was raining. I decided to go to a place called Alternative Motorsports. Um, I guess we're going to watch some cars on the dyno. Alright, we just got here. I uh, for, I left my camera in the car on accident. I had to go out and get it. So I've already been there and seen like a couple of the cars, but I haven't seen everything. I wanted to bring you guys with me. Alternative Motorsports in Yukon. NSX back here. Look at this. Oh man. This is the first one I've seen in real life. I have never seen an NSX before. That is sick. Got a boosted 350 over there, got a Corvette. We thought it was stock, but it has a supercharger on it. This is like a Mustang club. Mustang, Mustang, Mustang. Mustang, 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 Mustang. <laughs> Got a nice Fox. I really like these cars. I want an S550, but they're way too expensive. This is a twin turbo 50 with NOS. I've never seen a uh, twin turbo Coyote before. This is gonna be awesome. First run. Right. 700 yeah. wheel horse, 596 oh, foot pounds of torque, and it slipped off at the end. That's the fastest car I've ever seen. Run number two. Shout out to Alternative Motorsports. That was awesome. We're going to the uh, mall next, right? Yeah. So we're in the mall. Delta got his ring. And Caleb is thinking about playing this. What do you even do? Yeah, you know, the key. You gotta put the key through the, the hole there. And you get the shoes. If it pulls it, then it drops the shoe. All right, so we just got out of the mall. They decided that they're not gonna go to the drift event tonight because the, the turnout showed out kind of bad. I think I might head down there anyway. Um, 
I really don't have a whole lot to do. And I think I might go back to, the, I think I may go back to the OKC Auto Show today. It is currently 41 degrees, it feels like 35, and it's all nasty outside. It just doesn't look that, it just really doesn't look good. And the funny thing is, yesterday it was like, I think it was like 80 or 70 or 80. This is, this is Oklahoma for you. This is Oklahoma. So that's kind of, that's kind of putting a damper on all of the plans that I had for today. It is currently 4 p.m. I was gonna head to the drift meet like I mentioned before, but so the event says it goes from 8 a.m. until 11 p.m. But under the description box, it says 9.30 until 5 is the actual drift, actually like getting out on the track and drifting. So I'm not really exactly too sure and it's already four o'clock be down there GPS had to be down there around 4 45 4 50 if it does end at 5 then I just wasted an hour and a half of my life driving down there all right so as previously mentioned I am at the OKC Auto Show there's so many people We're here <laughs> oh this is gonna be awesome found the Chevy booth Look at this trunk space. It's a new wallet too. Yeah, I know. So we weren't able to test drive a car because the registration ends at five and they stopped doing test drives at 5.30 and it's like 6.30 now. So here's the NASCARs and there's the supercars over there. They got a Lamborghini, Audi R8, Maserati, just about everything you can want. All right, let's sit in this vet, man. I'm excited. That was oh, this is low. This thing is low to the ground, dude. This has a seven speed manual. I have never seen that before. Seven speed. There's six miles on this car. I haven't been vlogging much, but I got a lot of video for a uh, edit. So found a uh, 50 Mustang. Coyote. All these cars are like extremely comfortable. Okay, rant. Every car here, except for that Corvette, is automatic. Why? It's a <laughs> Ugh, Oh, you sink. One thing I'm noticing amongst all these cars is they're very roomy. Oh my god, it's a Prius. Oh, look at this tire shine though. There's a GT86. Before us boxer Subaru. All right, I'm in a King Ranch F-150, I believe, Super Duty. This thing is so tall, like, you guys can't tell, but this thing is ridiculously tall. And it has a sunroof. And it's a- Oh, look at that fan, though. What is this? Oh, oh, oh <laughs> GTR! Yes! Oh, can you sit in it? Shout out to Edgar from school. This is the ZTR you wanted. Oh, nice. Nismo 370Z. Chrysler 300. This is actually a car I wouldn't mind having. It's got the uh, tap shifters. This is what I want by the end of the year. This is nice. This is the car that I want to have before the end of 2017. This car is so awesome. Although I don't like that it's not automatic. I've never really liked the Challengers. I don't know why, I just never have. Just now leaving, it is currently 8.30 p.m. I had a lot of fun. So it is currently 10.22 p.m. Um, went and got some food, came home, and I've just been chilling since then. Kind of a boring day at the beginning, but over time it got a lot better. I got a lot more fun. And I went to that car, went to the auto show. It was a lot more fun than I thought it was gonna be. The video of the auto show will be out probably before this video. Sorry we didn't get to go to the drift event. I was really looking forward to going to the drift event today, but it kind of just didn't work out. Thank you guys so much for watching the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.